Okay, this is Emma Dilemma and this is Cup of Tea with Warner Music New Zealand. Mmm, I said no grey. Alright, five people dead or alive who I would form a super group with. Michael Jackson, definitely. Uh, Simon Neal from Biffy Claro. Uh, all three of the Beastie Boys. Oh, that's it. There you go. <laughs> the very first album that I owned, I think, was uh, Michael Jackson's History. Yeah, I was about five years old, and he he was touring the world. It was his Honest History tour. Begged my parents to go. And they were like, you can't go, but we got you something real special. And they got us the CD, and I was very disappointed. Oh, my favorite place in the world is Christchurch, New Zealand. Um, okay, so the other day I opened up the fridge, and there was like this really like off old moldy pot of yogurt, and it fell out and like splattered all over the floor and stunk. And then my cat came along and ate it. And so my spirit animal is the puddle of yogurt. Oh, my go-to karaoke song. I actually went to karaoke last week. What was the first thing I picked? Thing. Oh, I think it was, um, okay. My go-to karaoke song uh, is Hello by Adele. Cause I like to pretend that I can sing as good as her. I could be anyone else for a day. I think I would be my mum because I just want to like love myself that much and she loves me <laughs> I want to know what it feels like to love me that much <laughs> oh if I had a superpower I think it would be flying just because how amazing would it be to just yeet out just anywhere at any time with like hopefully no like fuel required, like you can just go as long as you want. That'd be that'd be sick. Oh, best piece of advice I've ever received from my mum is to save your money, like start young. Actually, no, scrap that one. The best advice I've ever received from my mum is uh, to start wearing sunscreen on your face every day from when you're young because uh, sun damage causes wrinkles and we can't be looking old, apparently. <laughs> oh, what can you expect from me in 2021? Uh, a lot. I've set this goal to try and release a song a month for the whole year and film a music video for every single one. And a lot of the music, like I love making music videos, so I'll either work with a director or quite a lot of them I'll shoot myself. So I'm really looking forward to that and I'm looking forward to releasing them out to the world and hoping that y'all like them.